Hi, today I would like to show you one card from my collection. This is Intel Rebi prototype, discrete graphics card from Intel. So let's overview the card. It has two gigs of RAM. Here you can see power connectors, some labels and video outputs. This card is not the first discrete graphics card by Intel. I have Intel 740, both PCI and AGP, in my collection as well. One card is in the box. You can see some useful information on the back. But let's return to our Larrabee card. I will put it into a test stand and launch it. Some lights are on. The fan is running at full speed. But there is no picture on monitor. Ok, let's try with other graphics cards. I will put this GeForce 480 signed by Jensen Huan in the first slot. Let's open Device Manager. Here we see GeForce card and system detects a little bit as coprocessor. We have no drivers installed. You see this? And uh, here are vendor and devs IDs. We have no drivers for Larrabee card, but uh, let's try to install software for Xeon Phi coprocessor. Here are the drivers. Xeon Phi is a successor of uh, Larrabee project. I will go to device manager and uh, try to update driver. Automatic update doesn't work, so I will try to add this manually. But also with no success. There is a special command in Xeon Phi software called MicCheck, which detects installed cards, but you see, no cards. Let's modify the drivers. I will just add vendors and devs IDs of Larrabee card into in file. So here, I will just change this for one. And also in this string. And uh, one more try. But uh, Windows encountered a problem. Uh, seems I need to run Windows uh, with disabled driver signature enforcement. Ok, let's repeat and install the drivers. Install this driver software anyway and we got it. So now the card is listed in device manager as Xeon Phi coprocessor. One more try with MIG check, but no devices. The card has an instance of FreeBSD inside, so maybe we just need to start it first. But uh, after a few minutes we got this error. Let's check the card status. It is trying to boot but with no success. So I will stop it. And now the cat status is ready. So without the correct driver, I cannot get this card running. So I need the correct drivers.